Claire, uh, before we let you go today, we're told here at NBC News that Donald Trump's legal team is preparing for the possibility of an indictment coming down today when a federal grand jury is expected to meet. Could happen today. We don't know for sure. Um, as a former prosecutor, what are you looking for? Any telltale signs here? What may happen today? Well, it's not a matter of if, it's a matter of when. I think for both Fannie Willis in Georgia and for Jack Smith in terms of a federal indictment, uh, what I'm going to be really interested in is who appears on the witness list for the government, who has been given immunity, uh, who has been told, we will not prosecute you, but you've got to tell us honestly everything that happened. You can't hide behind the Fifth Amendment. Um, the question is, for everyone who's working for Donald Trump right now, have you requested and received a rider on your employment contract that you get a million dollars a year for legal fees? Because if you add up the amount of money that people who foolishly went to work for this guy are spending on trying to keep themselves out of jail, it's a huge number. And Mark Meadows is, is, is one that has been mentioned earlier on the program. I think that is somebody who is in the room and listen to Donald Trump during those hours where he was doing nothing, when police officers were being attacked and people were being shot. He is the one that was in the room when they tried to get the votes out of Georgia fraudulently to deny the people of America a fair and free election. So it is one of those things that I think the witnesses and who's been given immunity is going to tell the tale over how much difficulty Donald Trump is actually going to have. And there was damning testimony, our viewers remember, last summer during the January 6th Select Committee hearings about how the chief of staff, Mark Meadows, performed that day on January 6th and sat back and let it happen. So we'll see if he's involved in all of this. Claire McCaskill, thank you so much. We'll see you very soon, I know. Come